A man puts on a black mask. Another man puts on a white mask. They enter a bare room and sit on two squares painted on the floor. What do you suppose they're up to? A clue. A young chimpanzee is put into the room with them. Watch. This was a scientific experiment in behavior. You see, in many ways, chimpanzees are similar to humans. They can manipulate objects with their hands. They eat the same kinds of food, even though their table manners are somewhat different. Young chimps play with things around them, just as young children do, and they're curious about anything they can get their hands on. This one can tune in its favorite program. And this one is a budding artist. It may not be able to tell the time, but it can hear the ticking. They like rough and tumble play, which would help prepare them for life in the wild by helping to build strong bodies. But they also do a lot of clinging to one another. How could that help them in the wild? That's one of the questions the masked men in the bare room are attempting to answer. The man in the black mask will cling to the chimp any time it enters the square. The man in the white mask will only play with the chimp. Even when the men change places, the chimps soon learn that the dark figure will only cling and the white figure will only play. The young chimps soon spend most of their time in the room playing with the man in the white. Now they're ready for an experiment. The young chimp is busy playing. Watch what happens when it hears a loud bell. It immediately stops playing and runs to the cling figure. When the level of excitement gets too high, the chimps use clinging to bring it down to a comfortable level, just as a child clings when it needs comforting. So the two masked men were tools with which to investigate the behavior of young chimpanzees and perhaps get a better understanding of human behavior. After many such tests, Dr. William Mason, a psychologist who has investigated the behavior of young chimpanzees, believes play and clinging are used to maintain a comfortable feeling of well-being by young chimpanzees and, very likely, by young children.